Hello, my name is Zolano Rabiola. I'm the founder and CEO of Gamso. And Ariel, what is Gamso? Gamso is a mobile gaming and animation company. Um, we create games and animation based on the African experience and we share it with the rest of the world basically. And how did the idea for Gamsol come about? Um, the idea for Gamsol came from university while I was in school. Um, I started as an individual developer creating application for different platforms. Uh, but I got much, very, very interested in the Microsoft platform because of my, uh, I was a student partner at the time. And uh, so, and I also represented Nigeria at the World Largest Technology Context, which was organized by Microsoft. So I got really exposed to their platform and I have a lot of interest in creating mobile games as well because of graphics. You also, you also got some investment from from ATH, from ATH MBH, yes, exactly. So that was much later after um, I started developing. Not really much later, but a couple of months after yeah. I started developing and started getting traction on um, the Windows platform. So one of my games at the time called um, Road Blazer got about 40,000 downloads very early on. So that was how I was able to pitch to 88 MPH and they invested. They gave us this first seed investment. And you're not on the Windows platform now, are you? No, now we've diversified. Yeah. So now we also have Android games. Um, we have a partnership with MTN, MTN Nigeria. Um, and that's for the game, the latest game you've got out, which is? Exactly. So we have a game with MTN Nigeria called Giddy Run, which is a local game. Uh, so MTN does like promotion. What's the story in the game? Okay, so <laughs> so I mean, essentially, the, the the game is supposed to you know portray the Nigerian environment and the day-to-day -day activities. You know, so the, a particular story that we used for the game was um, um, a scenario between a bus driver, a, a bus conductor, and yeah. driver to a wait. Um, what was it called? A policeman. You know, so the typical a policeman trying to collect bribe from a bus driver, but in this case, this bus driver is really crazy. It's yeah. called Shanko. So he decided not to stop and he just scattered, um, I mean, the police yeah. checkpoint. So it became like a chasing game, a 3D chasing game, where police, I mean, police started chasing this bus driver, this bus driver. So basically, this was uh, the concept. And once you see the game, you can tell that this is Lagos. This is, you know, yeah. uh, you can even guess the particular environment that we model the whole thing after yeah. so um, it's really also you're working with MTN on this game exactly so um, MTN so we I mean for the first six months it was exclusive for the MTN platform so they did a lot of promotion in order to get traffic for the game and I mean and so far it has been, it has, it has so been how does it work in money service? I mean so um, it's a subscriber based uh, uh, so a model I mean so you can either be paying 15 naira per week or 200 naira per month. Okay. You understand? So, so, how many subscribers have you got? The first month we got 25,000 subscribers, and yeah, it grew from then. Yeah. And what are your future plans? I mean, so our future plans, I mean, so we, we have different um, partnerships that we are currently working on. Uh, we're work, currently working with Diamond Bank. Is a, is a bank in Nigeria, one of the top banks in Nigeria, and uh, we are developing a huge portal which will be launched next month. Uh, we've moved pretty far in, in the development phase. Uh, so essentially, um, we are developing solutions that makes the bank um, have a better relationship with the youth, with the young people. Yes. You understand? When you look at the African market, like over fifty percent is between the age of you know uh, thirteen to twenty-five. Yeah. Over fifty percent. So that's huge. So that's really the market. So um, so for any big organization, they need to be able to target that audience. And I mean, a company like us, that's what we really do. And those are our real core audience so we are creating solutions to make banking fun for those people.